Good afternoon. You don't usually see me doing a live video, but I am going to be sharing with you my super fast, um, sorry, you don't usually see me doing a live video in the afternoon. Best laid plans are not always, <laughs> don't always happen. So, um, you know, there's just a lot of yucky sickness going on. And so I'm home today with some kiddos. And so I, um, they're down for naps and best, best way to get better is to uh, take a nap, right? It's fluids and, and um, take a nap. So I got some taxes to do. Ugh yucky. <laughs> uh, I need to get some paperwork done and some work work done, but I know that if I'm going to be sitting at the computer, I'm going to probably want to be snacking on something, to be completely honest with you. And so I was going to share with you my super fast um, meal or snack that I do, and it's the healthiest meal of the day that I have and it's so delicious and it just tastes just like a frappe from Starbucks and so I'm going to show you how super easy it is and I'm going to mix it all, all up for you and then I will not be snacking I will be enjoying my um, I'll be enjoying my my drink instead my shake instead so um, I many of you know I do health and fitness coaching and I've suffered from something called IBS for the longest time if you don't know me, my name is Katie Patterson Ingalls, and I have been doing health and fitness coaching for uh, 19 months now, and I had fallen down into a, a nasty little hole of, of taking care of everyone else and not putting myself first, and I, um, I was just, I was, my blood work was awful, I wasn't sleeping well, I was gaining weight, my IBS was more awful than it had ever been, and so I was desperate for something to change. Something had to change, and I really thought um, I was being tested for my thyroid because I thought that's what the problem was, and I also felt, to be truthful, just very depressed and low energy too. So all those symptoms seemed kind of right. That wasn't the case, um, and I really have focused on my nutrition and um, putting the right kinds of things into my body as well. So. Guys, super fast, super easy. This is my trick. This is what healed my stomach issues, and it's one of the first things that says helps support regularity and healthy digestion. Um, it truly has healed my IBS. It's done so many things for me. It supports healthy weight loss, healthy energy. Um, it's loaded with superfoods and phytonutrients. It's just, there's 70 different minerals and vitamins in the sucker, and um, it's got, everything's clean in it. You can trust it and it's not, there's no preservatives, there's no um, artificial flavorings, it's food. And if you let that thing sit around after it's been made for three hours, it's spoiled food. <laughs> so um, it's the real deal there. And it's truly a meal, it's not just a protein shake. So, but this is cuts, this has um, healed my stomach, it cuts my cravings. I often say um, that I was such a sugar addict and maybe some of you have heard my stories about that before. Um, <laughs> Jody, no problem. <laughs> it's okay if you gave me a sad face. I thought you were giving me a sad face about the kids. <laughs> That's funny. Um, I should turn my volume up. Thank you for the reminder. So um, anyways, Thanks for, for joining me, my live here. So this has just changed so much for me. My skin is healthier. My nails are stronger and healthier. They used to peel. Uh, my grandma always had nails that peeled and mine peeled too. They don't do that anymore. Um, my hair used to um, get to about here and it would just stop. And um, the gal who's been doing my hair for, oh my gosh, 15 years now. She's, so this, I just got my hair cut truthfully last month um, and look at this and we cut off like two inches and it's, it's just kind of it's crazy it's it's so healthy and um, my hair gal <laughs> Lindsay she'll tell you I've never seen your hair so healthy so I know I'm putting the right things into my body and um, I'm and this is this has been it right here it's been my go-to breakfast every morning I leave the house before by six o'clock every morning because I carpool I'm a working mom and um, a career mom and so I need a go-to because before I was either not eating breakfast or I was just drinking some coffee and maybe a granola bar that was not good for me so anyways this is the best thing I could do but um, 
I had it for breakfast and I know that this is going to help cut my cravings and not be sitting over there snacking at the computer while I'm doing some lovely taxes. So I decided, nope, you're going to make a shake. Why not show how easy this is? Because I get asked all the time by my challengers, what's your favorite recipe? How do you like to mix it up? And so that's what I'm going to do right now. Guys, um, I have a ninja. I was given a ninja for Christmas. I love my ninja. It makes a huge difference in how well everything gets mixed up. So I'm um, going to put everything in here. One scoop. One scoop of my cafe latte. They have many different flavors. Chocolate, vanilla, strawberry. I love anything coffee. Coffee flavor right here. So that's what I, one of those. They, um, anyone else sometimes have a hard time getting greens in? I you're gonna think, Katie, that's crazy. You're gonna taste it. I don't taste it at all. A cup of spinach going right in here. I do not taste it. I'm, I'm not kidding. I'm very picky. I'm gonna tell you right now that I'm a very picky girl <laughs> whenever it comes to how shakes taste because I was one someone who wanted a quick fix. A quick fix. What's that pill? What's that go-to diet shake? What's that wrap? That's whatever. Um, and I tried many different shakes. I could not just choke it down and be okay with it. It has to taste good too. So um, this is the healthiest thing for you. It's a meal and it's also proven to lower your, the only product out there that is proven to, clinically proven by doctors, <laughs> over a hundred doctors to lower your blood pressure and your cholesterol and help with your sugars. So, um, okay, just dump some spinach in there. Tastes delicious, you won't even taste it. Has anyone seen the cinnamon peanut butter? I have like this much on there, half a teaspoon maybe going in. This stuff is so delicious. I gotta tell you something that's funny. Callan, my daughter, she'll, they, she loves peanut butter and jelly sandwiches. She says, mommy, I don't want none of that dirty, that dirty peanut butter. I'm like, dirty peanut butter? Oh, it's cinnamon. It's got little flecks in there. <laughs> I think it's funny. All right. Um, I am lactose intolerant. I'm toler um, milk has kind of always bothered my stomach. It, it, it's actually is in the family. Um, my grandma is lactose intolerant. It bothers my dad's stomach too. I always thought it was weird because everybody else loves milk. I don't really care for milk. I'll be honest with you. It makes me sad, um, but I it I don't really care for the taste, and it actually would bother my stomach. And so, don't get me wrong. I love me some ice cream, but um, a lot of milk products just bother my stomach. I love this coconut milk. Love this. Our local country mart carried it they are recently closed and so I don't know what I'm gonna do because Walmart does not carry this so how much do I pour in I'll be honest I'm just really dumping um just dumping I also put in um, a whole thing of cold coffee it's gonna have cold coffee in there and um, a little bit of honey just a tiny little bit of honey squirted in here because you want to have a little bit of sweet and it's it's okay because it's a natural honey and especially I use honey a lot in things especially when I'm baking because it helps cut my um, help with my allergies local honeys that are made around here so and then about a cup of ice done I'm gonna put it in my ninja I'm going to um, blend the sucker up and I'm gonna go sit over there and